Um, you've often said that the world should normalize hooking up with your friends. Um, why do you oh, love yeah. hooking up with your friends? So I've said this more about like my girlfriends, not my guy friends. I, <laughs> I had to clear this up on like Michael Sartain's podcast because like I would get so weird if I hooked up with my guy friend. Like there's just no getting around it. I don't mm. know what it is when I hook up with a man, I get attached immediately. And I'm like, mm. well, that's weird. I hook up with my girlfriends and it's like, we can just go back to being besties right afterwards. There's n- like no attachment feeling. Mm-hmm. And that's like the amazing part. And it's like, especially when I'm like, making content for OnlyFans. It's like my friend Kristen, for example, it's like she eats pussy better than like anyone I've ever met. Um, So when she ate me out, I was over here like literally fantasizing about her, but still only thinking of her like a best friend. So I'm Mm -hmm. like normalize this Mm because this is awesome, especially because so I'm like bisexual, but heteroromantic. So it's like when I hook up with women, I'm so turned on. I love it. But like afterwards, I'm just back to being like besties. And that's Mm -hmm. like just great to me. So normally is hooking up with you, especially like girls for your girlfriends, because they'll know how to like lick your clit better than a man ever will. In Mm -hmm. my opinion, men suck at that stuff. They like I've literally dated men who don't even know how to like put a vibrator on my clit. Like they're just missing it entirely. Yeah. Do you think that um, I mean, have you ever, so have you ever been with a guy who's been, you know, really bad at eating you out? And Every guy, except for, um. Do you give them direction? Here's the thing. <laughs> I have, well, okay, so for actually most guys, because like, for example, I didn't even think I liked being eaten out until my friend Kristen ate me out. It mm-hmm. was Kristen and Sarah, and we were all doing like a three-way it was, she was actually like, Kristen was teaching like a pussy eating class in this video that we have. It's on OnlyFans if you guys want it. <laughs> um, but she was teaching us how to eat pussy. And I was over here like, all right, I'm going to have to like fake this blah, blah, blah. And then like, we started filming the video and I was like, and this was only last year. First person to ever eat me out and be good. Hmm. So, and I haven't really hooked up with a guy since. I just thought I didn't like being eaten out. So I always told guys like, just don't even bother eating me out. Like you're going to be it's kind of like, I, I just always thought I didn't like being eaten out. And it just turned out everyone who had tried eating me out sucked. And I just thought I'd, I'm not sensitive enough. Like I would just always hand guys vibrators. They can't even take direction for vibrators. <laughs> so you, okay. So you haven't been eaten out by a guy since you hooked up with this girl. I haven't been eaten out by a guy in probably like six or seven years. Wow. Oh. And I would just like always give guys vibrators. And even then, like the the guy who I made OnlyFans content with, the only guy, and I haven't hooked up with anyone since him. He I told him, like, please eat me out. He he didn't want to, but he would kind of just like make like he would just I'd be like, Can you eat me out? And then he'd start doing something else to me. Cause just, you know, like avoidant. Mm-hmm. And then um, <laughs> or like he would tell me to use my vibrator on myself while I like sucked his dick. So I feel like he didn't have to do work. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Like his dick, his dick just hit my G spot really great. And I think he relied on that a lot, Mm -hmm. but he didn't try to do anything else or he would like finger me. But like when he fingered me, he'd make me start bleeding all over the place. And I'm like, do you need to like cut your nails or something? Because like that shouldn't be happening. Yeah. I think most, um, the, you know, when I've talked to like lots of different sex experts and, you know, I've obviously talked to a lot of sex workers and they like kind of talk about the advice that they give to guys. One of like the one things that I hear over and over again is to take your time because I think for guys, it's very easy for them to get to like zero from zero to 60, like kind of right away, you know, they can get hard and like be ready to go right away. But like women take time, like they're like a fire that you need to like stoke and, you know, like slowly let it grow. And so you can't really start usually eating a girl out and she's going to come in like five seconds. Some girls are like that, See, if you but use most girls are not Hitachi on me. Yeah. But that's like this incredibly powerful, like <laughs> battery operated fucking like <laughs> massager. Like, two minutes. like you have to come. It's like, it like makes you, I like went live yesterday and like, like I, once I hit like a certain tip goal, I was like, all right, I'm going to start using my Hitachi. And after like two minutes, I'm like, all right, I need to put it away. Cause I'm about to squirt. And you guys have not hit this 
like tip goal to have me squirt yeah <laughs> so let's get to that tip goal because it's like I got so close way sooner than I thought I was going to yeah yeah <laughs> but yeah it just makes sense and um being eaten out honestly I haven't come from being eaten out yet because I, I definitely get like a little like frightened I, I, every guy I've ever hooked up with when I squirt they all think it's gross I've never had a guy who's like oh my god that's the coolest thing ever so I get stage fright like coming in front uh. of people that aren't my only fans people because my only fans subs are like oh my god that is the coolest thing I've ever seen and then people in person are like I have to like go clean that up now and I'm like I'm sorry can't help it that's such a shame (laughs) that is really sad 